Hey guys, this is Gloria. I am back to share with you guys a collective haul um, from eBay as well as scrapbook.com and then um, also some goodies from Hobby Lobby um, that I'll share with you guys. But first, I wanna share um, my winnings from Wandy Sweets. I believe that's her name here on YouTube as well as on Instagram, but I won her Instagram giveaway and it was for these dyes from Coco and Reno. Um, Coco Marino is um, doing um, their, their, they, I guess they produce dyes and they are a part of Peachy Cheap, which is a daily deal site. And now they have a um, subscription for their Dye a Month Club. And you can go on and um, subscribe to that and they'll send you the new dyes every month. And so um, these are the dyes that I actually won. And it was so funny because I won two of the girls giveaways on Instagram. It was Wandy and it was also um, Lily who is crafting with Liller um, here on YouTube. And I believe that may be her name as well on Instagram. And so I, I, Wandy contacted me first. So then when Lily contacted me, I asked her, I said, well, can I um, gift it to someone else? And she told me yes. So I gave her um, someone's name to gift the other word circles to because I definitely don't need two sets. And I was super excited that she allowed me to gift my winnings onto someone else. I really did appreciate that. So thank you ladies for that. And I did wanna show that I did receive my dyes from Coco and Reno. Um, then I'm gonna show what I picked up um, from eBay. It's just one item. I picked up the Willow Lane um, Maggie Holmes ephemera pack and um it is such a cute set oh my gosh love 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 it um i believe i paid 575 for this and then it was free shipping so not too bad you know but this is what it has in the inside of it super duper cute so i was glad to have picked up that um from scrapbook.com i picked up this maggie holmes magnet studio and i've already opened it up and was kind of playing with the clings that are in here but it comes with a set of seven clings. Um, it's these roses here, this blue set, and then this is actually counted as four pieces. These little flourishes, they're counted as four pieces, and then this is counted as one right here. And so what you do is you use these on your magnet boards, or you can even put them on the refrigerator. You can put them on anything that cling will cling to. And so this was on clearance for like $3 and some change. And so I went on and picked that up because you guys know I just shared um, a board that I picked up from a thrift store that I wanted to alter and use that on. So super excited to play with that. Um, then I also, um, well, I'll say this. I received this in the mail. This is not what I ordered from scrapbook.com. Um, it's super cute, but it's not what I ordered. So I did contact them and let them know that they sent me the wrong chipboard set. Um, I wanted the Willow Lane chipboard set and they sent me this one. And then when I contacted them, they said that they were all out of the Willow Lane, but that they, they would send it to me as soon as they get it in, which will be in about a week or two. So I was like, okay, that's fine. And they told me to go ahead and keep that chipboard set. And so that is the Hooray chipboard set. And I'm wondering if this goes with that paper that was at Tuesday morning. I'm not sure, but it is super cute. And so the next thing that I picked up was this 12 by 12, um, my mind's eye splendor paper and accessories kit. Now, Peachy Cheap had this a while back and I did not get it. Oh my gosh. I'm like kicking myself in the butt for not getting it when they had it. So I had to go on scrapbook.com and get it and, and pick it up. It was $7.99 on there and it, um, you know, it comes with uh, six sheets of paper and it also comes with um, this sticker sheet right here. So I'm not going to take the paper out because it's going to make a lot of noise. And I know that some people don't like to hear all of that rattling noise, but the patterns are right here on the front. And it's, you know, double-sided. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is like the B side and this is the A side right here for that. And sorry about the glare. So I did pick that up. I just think this paper set is so cute. And I'm really hoping that Tuesday morning gets it in the 12 by 12 as well. Because they did have the 6 by 6 which I picked up um, probably about a week ago. 
and I also now have the um, the stamps for that as well. I also picked up some single sheets um, of paper as well, and this is um, the crepe paper Sunny Days. And so I just picked up just a you know just a few pieces. I thought this one was super pretty with the yellow background and pink flowers. I love that combination. And then this one is also crepe paper, and I believe this is flourish. Yep, this is flourish. I just thought that would be super cute, especially if I wanted to make some type of layout. I really want to get back into kind of making layouts and stuff. Um, then this one is called Splendid, and this is by um, Maggie Holmes as well, and it's the flourish collection, and it's just pink on the back. And then this one is Gal Meets Glam. And I just love these glasses. So I wanted to pick up a sheet of that just in case I want to make like a um, traveler's notebook or some type of journal with it or something like that. And it has eyelashes on the opposite side. The next one is this one by Crepe Paper. And it says, happiness, happiness looks a lot like being with you. And I thought that was super cute. And this one on the opposite side is the willow you know it's by willow lane it's called daydream and it has all of these cut aparts on it and i just love 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 the little cut aparts super cute so i picked that one up um and then this is penelope i picked up the six by six from um tuesday morning but i wanted to have these swans um in a larger sheet i just thought it was so pretty so i picked up two of those and this is the a side and this is the b side it's polka dot on the opposite side and then also for Penelope, I picked up this one right here. It was like really cheap. I think like 60 something cent or something. But it's just those little flag type banners and stuff. And you can actually fussy cut those out if you want it. And then I love the back side of this as well. It's like a pinky peach corally kind of color. And then there's a piece of chipboard that they ship the paper with um, so that your paper won't get ruined. So love that. And then last but not least from scrapbook.com, I did um, get the Willow Lane um, 12 by 12 paper. And um, I didn't have this one and I was super excited to have gotten it. Um, let me just do, just in case you haven't seen it, I'll do a half of a flip through showing you the bottom part of the paper. But it's super pretty. This looks like embroidery, it's so pretty. And I love the blues in there, um, even though I'm like a pinky stinky girl. Look how pretty that is. I love the fact that that has like the gold scallops on it, because you guys know I love scallops. But it's a very pretty paper. I wanted it in a six by eight as well. Um, and I, you know, they also have like, they, I think they got like two different six by eight pads, but this pad is so pretty. It's more basic, though, than a lot of the Maggie Holmes. Um, you know, it kind of reminds me more of, like, background papers. Look at those houses. I love houses, too, guys. I love everything, right? So cute. Very, very, I love that. Very, very pretty paper. And look at these. I love this. You can cut these out. Fussy cut them out. They're so cute. And then that one, and then there's that same one. Happiness looks a lot like being with you. Super cute. And then here's some cut aparts right here. So, so cool. So those are the things that I picked up from scrapbook.com. And then I'll share um, my small haul from uh, Hobby Lobby. And so this is when they had their... Um, 50% off blowout sale. So I picked up these um, happy birthday um, stickers and they're super cute, beautiful colors. And then I also picked up this one and this is, um, I actually have the paper kit for this one, um, it, but it is so pretty. You don't have to necessarily use it for baby stuff, but so pretty, it can be used for like birthdays and stuff like that. Very, very cute. Um, I also picked up the girls again, and I've picked these up before, but I wanted to go ahead and rebuy them, especially after I saw Wandy's um, little house that she made. She made a Kleenex house box, box, house box, yeah. Um, <laughs> kind of like what I made, but then she altered hers a little bit, and I love the way hers came out. And she also used the little girl on there. So I thought that was a super cute idea. So I went on and picked those up. 
I also picked up these the little puffy girls. I've been seeing these on everybody's channels and I thought those were cute as well. These are from Agenda 52 and these were only a dollar and 50 cents. So not a bad deal and you get 12 girls on there. So not a bad deal at all. I also picked up these. Um, my birthday is this month. So I wanted to pick these up to kind of decorate my planner a little bit with them maybe and then use them on other projects. So these are so pretty. And then I also picked up the hearts because I just could not resist the little hearts. Super duper cute. They're dimensional and they kind of look like epoxy on the top. They're very, very cute as well. So I picked up those stickers. And then um, anytime they have the, um, the blowout sale, I always pick up the printable um, vellum because I love making um, my own vellum. Uh, papers so I picked up two packs of those they're regular $4.99 and I caught them for um you know $2.50 each and um last but not least I also picked up um this frame and it was on clearance and I'm guessing it was on clearance because it did not have the glass in there but I just thought it was so cute and so retro let me turn it this way it's like a five by seven frame and it has the little Older on the back and I swear I just keep buying frames guys I'm like in a frame mood and I have no place to put them but I just love that one and it was on clearance so I went on and picked it up so I think that is about it that is all I'm just looking around to see if there's anything else I need to share with you guys but I think that oh you know what I got some goodwill stuff I can share real quick I don't drop it all on the floor, right? Um, so let me show this stuff to you real quick. Um, this stuff was from last week. You guys know I love shopping at Goodwill for um uh crafty items. So this was only 50 cent, and it's just some white cray paper I can make um rosettes out of. So I went on and picked that up. Um, I also found this one, and this one was peach, and it was also 50 cent, beautiful color beautiful beautiful color so i picked that up and then this light pink i thought this light pink was so pretty so let me show you because it's not like the darker pink it's like a really pretty light baby pink i was super excited to find that and it was also only 50 cent uh oh sorry and i also picked up this big green pack and i thought that would look cute with like the willow lane and the flourish collection and this one was 99 cent but it was huge and i bought it because you know goodwill they do employ people and help people find jobs and all that good stuff so um i also picked up this mold that i was going to use for resin and it was 99 cent and you can make four hearts i thought that was super cute and that's how it looks I found um, this trim and it was 99 cent. There's not a lot on here, but I thought it was a very unique, very pretty trim. So I went on and picked that up as well. Um, and it was 99 cent. So not a lot on there, but it's super pretty. And then I also found this cartridge for my Xyron and it is the permanent adhesive and it was 399, cannot beat that. Um, I also picked up this basket. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that or not, but it was 99 cents and it's a pretty nice size basket. All of this stuff that I just showed you was inside that basket. So a nice size basket to put some goodies down inside of the store away. So now I think that is it. I think I've shared with you guys everything that I have. And as always, guys, if you have any questions or comments, just leave them down below and I'll get back with you as soon as I possibly can. Take care, guys. Bye.